Some new Toyota vehicles are equipped with front seat systems designed to reduce the potential for whiplash injury in the event of certain types of rear-end collisions. Whiplash injuries, which can result from some rear-end collisions, are among the most common forms of injury experienced in traffic accidents. Whiplash can occur when the occupant's head and upper body move in opposite directions in response to a collision, causing strain on the neck. Two separate Toyota technologies are employed to help reduce the likelihood of whiplash during certain low-speed rear-end collisions. Either whiplash injury lessening seats, known as WIL seats, or active headrests. While both have similar functional goals, they do so in different ways. Some Toyota seats are designed to support the head and body so they move together simultaneously if the vehicle is hit from behind. These are called WIL seats. The WIL seat backs feature rigid side frames that keep the occupants securely located, along with a thick cushioned central support area that compresses, permitting the upper body to sink into the seat back if the vehicle is hit from behind. The headrest is shaped in position so the head and upper body are both supported at the same time, reducing the potential for whiplash. With active headrests, if the vehicle is struck from behind, the force of the occupant's lower back pressing against a mechanism in the seat back triggers the headrest to move almost instantly forward and upward. Reducing the distance between the head and the head restraint can help reduce the risk of whiplash to the seat occupant. Even small forces applied to the seat back may cause the head restraint to move. That movement is normal and does not indicate a problem. When adjusting the height of the head restraints on some seats, be sure to push in the lock button before moving the restraint. Adjust so the center of the restraint is in line with the top of the occupant's ears. The features and functions described in this video might not be applicable to your Toyota model. See your owner's manual for details. Thanks for watching this Know Your Toyota video.